Hey, Nobles, well, it's Mayor Chris Jensen coming to you from City Hall back inside because it is freezing outside for another edition of the Friday Five this wonderful holiday weekend. And we have a lot to cover this weekend. So I'm going to say it's the five things you need to know going into the weekend, but it's really like 18 things. So just prepare yourself. Uh, first things first for this today. First of all, it's Friday, December 6th, 2024. First thing, some INDOT projects, Department of Transportation. We got some funding for uh, some projects, $3.56 million from INDOT as part of their Highway Safety Improvement Program. The three projects that we receive funding for include improving the two-way stop at the intersection of 156 and Olio Road into a roundabout far east side, absolutely necessary. Second, an installation of intersection bump outs and additional striping and signage along 10th Street near North Elementary School, a very heavily traveled and also heavily kid-friendly area of the city. So I'm excited for that improvement. And then also we're going to replace older roadway signs in Old Town and other parts of Noblesville. So thanks to our friends at uh, INDOT for helping to fund some local projects here. Be looking forward to those going forward here in the next couple of years to make our community even that much more safe. Second thing, tonight is the first Friday of the month in December, and boy, do we have a lineup for you. So I'm going to go over several things that are happening um, and, and just be prepared to be very busy tonight if you head downtown Noblesville. First thing, Noblesville Main Street's Deck the Downtown buses will be providing free travel to downtown. Seminary Park, Noblesville Creates, Federal Hill Commons, and Downtown Merchants will be open late tonight for evening shoppers. Second thing, Noblesville Preservation Alliance will host its annual holiday home tour from 5 to 8 p.m. This year's tour promised to be an enchanting showcase of exquisitely decorated homes and community spaces nestled in various corners of our city. Awesome organization, wonderful event. Also, join me at Lights Over Seminary uh, in partnership with our friends at the Preservation Alliance. Uh, it's a free walkable holiday light display in Seminary Park. Tonight's opening night event is from 5.30 to 8 p.m. with an official lighting taking place at, place at 6 p.m. at Seminary Park. This year, the Indiana Peony Festival's Nobles of Flower Market will coincide with the festivities at Light Silver Seminary. Enjoy flowers, carols, hot carolers, uh, hot chocolate, and hear me reading Twas the Night Before Christmas at 6.15 p.m. I hope you'll join us tonight for that. I'm looking forward to it. All right, our friends at Noblesville Youth Assistance Program are doing their Stuff Your Stocking. It's a fundraising event where families can purchase a stocking and embark on a festive trick-or-treat style tour of local businesses. At each participating business, you'll fill the stocking with goodies, such as small toys, treats, and other festive items. The stockings are $15 and raise funds for holiday assistance. That's going on downtown. Noblesville Creates, which is there on South 8th Street, will have its gifted exhibit and a showcase from artist Eric Utterbeck from 5 to 9 p.m. Tonight there at Noblesville Creates. The Ice Plaza is open tonight from 5 to 9 p.m. Get out there and ice skate. Carriage rides back by popular demand. Families can reserve a unique private 15-minute carriage ride through downtown Noblesville, carriage rides begin tonight and are available 4 to 9.30 p.m. December 13th, 14th, 19th, and 20th. So check out Noblesville Parks Department to learn more about that. Got to turn over my paper so I can keep on rolling. So that's all the activities tonight in downtown. That was really kind of a way that we cheated. The second thing you need to know. Third thing you need to know, the holiday market. Join Noblesville Main Street and the City of Noblesville Parks and Recreation Department for a wonderful day at, at Federal Hill Commons. The annual holiday market runs 11 to 4 tomorrow uh, there at Federal Hill Commons. Artisans, makers, bakers, and more will help fulfill your holiday gift needs. Make a day of it and enjoy ice skating at the plaza as well there at Federal Hill Commons tomorrow. Fourth, tomorrow night, it's the Holiday and Lights Parade, the 2024 Holiday and Lights Parade, sponsored by Hair Chevrolet and your Central Indiana Chevy dealers, begins at 6.30 p.m. Saturday night, tomorrow night. Stephen and Moffat Craig, just incredible human beings, will serve as this year's Grand Marshals, and Santa will be the last entry in the parade. Stephen Moffat, Moffitt, Adrian's Flores, they're retiring at the end of the year, and they're just wonderful community members, so we're honored to have them as our Grand Marshals. The parade will start at 16th and Harrison, travel along south to Logan Street, north uh, to 9th Street, then east to Harrison before heading back to 16th Street. So a little bit won't go down Monument like a lot of our normal parades do. So just a little bit of a deviated route there down Harrison Street, but pretty much the same route that we take for most of our parades. This is going to be an exciting parade. We have more entries than at any other parade in recent memory. So we're excited for this year's Holiday Lights Parade, and I'll look forward to seeing you along the parade route tomorrow night. 
6.30 in downtown. And then finally, back to our friends at INDOT. They are hosting a public meeting uh, in partnership with the city of Noblesville. So they're kicking off our State Road 37 improvement project. So that project's going to run from Greenfield Avenue to the north. Um, looking forward to that. NDOT's hosting a public information meeting regarding the project, 6.30 p.m. this coming Wednesday at Noblesville High School. Attendees should enter through Gate 1. Uh, the project will include improvements along State Road 37 from south of Greenfield Avenue to north of State Road 32. The goal of the project is to address traffic congestion and pedestrian and vehicular safety along the 37 corridor. Representatives from NDOT, the city, Lock Mueller Group, and American Structure Point will provide information and gather feedback about the projects. All right, those are five hefty things you need to know going into this weekend. Again, we have some road stuff, but we have a lot of fun going on too. So I look forward to seeing so many of you in our downtown and around the city of Noblesville this weekend as we continue to kick off and celebrate the holiday season here in our wonderful city. You have questions about the Friday Five? Uh, give me a call here at City Hall. Shoot me an email, cjensen at noblesville.in.gov. Text me, call me on my cell phone, 317 317- 509-3134. Stay warm, check in our neighbors, and enjoy a wonderful holiday weekend here in Noblesville. And we'll see you back here next Friday for another edition. Is Friday the 13th, by the way? Ooh, all right. Friday the 13th. Well, holiday Friday the 13th. Next Friday for another edition of the Friday Five.